Hello again and welcome back to Super Mario World. So in our last video we finally made it through the Forest of Illusion and now we're in the Chocolate Land. Sounds tasty. And as you can see on my last video it was pretty short. So I'm gonna see how Chocolate Land turns out to be. So before we get started be sure to leave a like and subscribe on this video. So with that out of the way let's begin on this first level. And we got ourselves some new enemies. These giant dinosaur things. Trying to chase me. And a brief fire. That's new. And I already lost my thing. Everything is going on. Too many things at the same time. Let me just get through this. Shot me in the cannon. Nice try. Yeah, let me see if I can jump on top of this. No, I didn't. Come on. There we go. Now let's take care of these guys. Mm. With our Yoshi. Never mind. You know what? I'm not even going to bother with Yoshi. One of these areas has to have a secret. Side shooting me off in a cannon. I got a new thing. A fire power. Just carrying that one of the items. And already I'm trying to lose my voice. Choco Ghost House. That's a new title. Honestly, these ghost houses are a piece of cake. Piece of chocolate cake, if you will. <laughs> and we got ourselves one of those fishing ghost things. Try not to touch the fire. Missed up. There we go. And one of these ghosts is turned into a block or a brick. I'm gonna have to lead these ghosts just to follow me into this area so I can jump on top of this, top of them. There we go. Thank you, ghost. You're very helpful. And there's the exit. Alright, so just like in the Forest of Illusion, there's going to be some different directions to go. So I'm going to have to go into different... to find the hidden area and all that. I'm just going to go circle to circle if this doesn't turn out. Here's the coin you collected or the time remaining can change your progress. Can you find the special goal? So basically you're going to have to find a secret, a certain area to the exit. I'm already wasting precious time. So basically I'm going to find 
one certain area that can help me find the exit. So, basically this one, for, for example, I just lost Yoshi, has different rooms or area or whatever change the temp depending on which coins I believe they said you collect let's just go see probably I'm just gonna have to change or edit some parts in the video on this one I don't know if it's this part of the area or not we're just gonna have to see Take care of these dinosaurs. There we go. Alright, here it is. So let's move on to the next. Actually, I'm just skipping that level to come back for it later. Hmm. And I belched a little bit because I had a lunch or dinner a large meal all right let me see if yoshi's there nope it's just the feather that's fine let's just move on Get up there. One more time. Alright, this time one more. There we go. And we got ourselves a lot of coins in this secret world. Okay, there we go. Well, that's fine, let's keep on going. Just try to go back. Got myself the feather again. And this is where I just left off. So let's continue on. Second time I lost my stuff. Yeah, at least we got to the finish line. Yeah, I can't talk today. So basically, the after beating this level, it's just taking me circle to circle, so I'm gonna have to find a secret area because even, no matter how much I try, I'm just gonna be back for where I started. Alright, let me just borrow this. Alright. So as I was saying, if I had Yoshi, then probably it might be easier for me to get through this. Or at least have a feather like this one. This one, excuse me. So I can just glide up there and get through this area without any trouble.
Well, there is a trick, but you have to do it perf perfectly. So from right here, I'm going to have to do a glide over there. It's not going to be easy. Just clear this off so this guy can get out of the way. Like that. And I made it. That's the secret area. So now I finally got through this, we can continue on with our chocolate fortress. Hopefully this isn't going to be another one of those direction path things. Alright, this is going to be simple enough. And somehow, I would assume that Bowser is still there shooting fireballs, but it's something else. Try not to get hit by these woods. Take my time. There we go. just to get through these guys. Mm -hmm. You're no match for me. Heh, one of them is stuck. Ha ha. Well, this is getting tricky. He's stuck too. That's cool. I mean, cool for me because I don't have to struggle dealing with these things. And we made it to the fortress boss. Smiling at me like it's a joke when it's clear that you're not going to win. Because I already beat you. On to the next world. Alright. Let's go for a little slide. Can't tell this is either boiling oil or chocolate. I just don't want to touch one of them. Just make it in one piece. And there's one, most of the one-ups. But too bad we can't get to it. We'll just get it later. Or sometimes. Actually, we can get it. Okay, never mind. And somehow there's a secret passage, or one of those pow things. There it is. Let's get to it, shall we? Alright, so from here on I can't speak. Which direction is it? I'm trying to get to this part, but fortunately it won't let me. Well, that's fine because it doesn't matter. And we got ourselves a mighty mole. Mighty Monty or whatever. Let me switch to my 
superhero cape. We're done. On to the next. Alright, we got ourselves more spinies. And Yoshi. Time to eat up. I mean, how is it possible for Yoshi to get through those through these blocks trying to get that those enemies? I'm almost choking, tongue twisting. And of course, it's another one of those bonus game. I mean, that's fine. I already took care of that. is the next one. Too many fish. There we go. Now we can move on. We're done. So now we're in Castle 3, Wendy's Castle, so let's see what Wendy is up to. At least they got all their names over there. Ooh, that's... I gotta be careful with that. a close one. And also a close one too. Gotta make it in right position. Oh, that was a that was actually a close one. Also another thing you need to know is that if you're trying to glide up and get hit by an enemy, then that's fine because you won't take that much damage. <sighs> of course I did. At least for my cape. slower. Just take your sweet time. There we go. Ooh, that was a close one too. I thought I was going to make it. But I did. I keep forgetting I still have that spin attack. And we made it to Wendy's door. And as you can see, it's the same thing. But with two fireballs. And most of the pipe is in perfect position. I messed up in that. Let's try this again. Yeah, come on. Time is running out. Just one more and I'm done. Dumb. Boom. Bye bye, Wendy. Another egg saved. So what do we have now, Mario? 
Now it looks like he's cleaning up the mess, literally, with a large paintbrush or mop. Wendy Okupa is. Ugh, Wendy Okupa Castle 6 has sludged her last song, sung her last song. Mario must meet the cha challenge that is now before him. There is a sinking ship that appeared to be a gateway to the Valley of Bowser. And I'm choking at that part. So we finally made it to the part of the sunken ship. But we're not going to go over there just yet. So we're going to have to check on some of the star roads for a moment before we get any further. So let's continue on with that. I'm going to do a little editing on that part though. Now that in, we're in one of the star road, let's go check on one of the uh, world. Based on the um, area, we'll have to go into one of the levels just to save some special eggs. So this is the red egg. I'm guessing the red egg is Red Yoshi or one of the Yoshi's friends. And let's just grab one of the wings and get through this. Oh, Yoshi's about to swallow it. On to the next part. And if I messed up, I can just go back. Get to start over to get what I need. See where this area takes me. Now, what do you know? It's a secret room. You know what? I just decided not to go through this part, so we're just gonna skip this. And on to the next place. I really wanted to check that out because that secret area leads to the final place of our hometown. I'm just not going to spoil it. Probably I did. As you can see, we already checked that, so I'm pretty sure we can find the remaining star road. I'm going to try out that one world one more time depending on how much it takes me to get through it. This world. Yeah, what do you know? I found the key. So let's check what world this is. Oh, there's a pipe over there, so that's nice. And what do you know? It leads me to the Koopa Palace. And there's one of the Star Road right there. Let's go to the Chocolate Secret. This guy's hideous. Doesn't matter, because... I messed up. Ah, oh boy. Just dodging these football. Let me try this. Get through this part. There we go. You're done. Not anymore. Okay, let's 
let's just try not to get hit by this guy. There we go. Man, you're no fun. But at least I made it safely. Just trying to take my time with these guys. And boy. Gotta make this real fast because it's getting shorter. Thank you. Too many of those football guys. Made it. Alright, so we're done with this. Let's just see where this leads us. Right back to this area. Alright, so looks like we're going to have to end this video, so thank you for watching this. Hopefully I'll try to pronounce things right next time once again. Now if there's anything you like about this content, again, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. So until then, I will see you again in the next video.